So one way you can deal with aphids is to spray them with a pesticide and you've got great brands like Bug Ultra and things like that. But also you've got sort of more organic or environmentally friendly uh, versions uh, like this brand here. I don't know whether this is uh, something that is still available. This is a very old bottle that I'm reusing, but you can see this is a, a more environmentally friendly, pet safe, child safe version. But also you can use washing up liquid for aphids as long as you can spray directly onto the aphids themselves because the soapy water will clog up the pores on the backs of the aphids, which is where they breathe through. And again, you can get proper insecticide soaps, which are very good. But I say a lot of people like to use this. Now, the trick is not to make it too strong that you're damaging the plant and stopping the plant's uh, processes. So for every three litres, you want about a teaspoon of normal strength washing up liquid. Obviously, if it's double strength, you will want half that. And I usually say you want about a sixth of a spoon per 500 mil. So that's about a sixth of a spoon there. And all I'm going to do is pop that into this bottle and add the water. I've got some very sickly broad beans. You see it's got some ants on it there and it's the uh, ants that are farming the aphids there. So they're actually protecting the aphids from predators uh, so that they can get the excretions from the aphids. So all I'm going to do is I've got my bottle there of me washing up liquid, give it a good shake. And if you're unsure whether it's uh, got the right dilution, you can just spray it onto something. And if you see bubbles, that's fine. If it's extremely thick and bubbly, you've made it too strong and you need to dilute it. So what we do there is just spray directly onto the aphids. Try to do this either early in the morning or in the evening when there's not full sun on it. And you're trying to get sort of on the, spray the aphids directly, spray plenty on. If you're worried about the plants, you can always come by in a few hours and give it a good rinse off with a can or a hose. But you might find that you want to then keep coming back and spraying. And I would do that anyway. I would each day, once I've seen a, an aphid outbreak, I would spray. And this will work for black fly, white fly, or any type of aphid.